guys welcome back to the channel today me and lisa down in mid wales we found this absolute gorgeous little time capsule house we want to have a look at it's freezing isn't it yeah brought out the heavy duty coat now it's winter now and we're in wales so weather's never good but uh just getting to sunset now so we've got some nice views over there and we're gonna head straight up to this house see what we can find so right now guys we're heading up this steep hill you can see how overgrown the path into the house is it's unreal it's dead muddy slipping everywhere the stuff we go through for this channel is unreal but just check out that proper golden hour just see the top of the house there I hope it's the right one otherwise we're about to crash in on someone watching Cory. never a good sign so uh <laughs> Jesus Christ this is what I'm dealing with daily right let's head up we keep going we push forward so we're at the top of the hill we've uh, got to the house I just want to show you this because it creeped me out <laughs> 90s Beckham and Roy Keane scared the hell out of me because their little heads popped up. Ready? Yeah. Check that view last time before we head inside. Oh. Let's go. So guys we're inside and as you can see this place has absolutely everything left behind. We don't really have a date or anything from when the place was abandoned so we'll have to do a bit of investigating as we walk around. The nickname for this house is the Puzzle House. But look at this living room. It's a proper little hideaway isn't it? Yeah. You know like where it is and that. Lisa's straight in there. Having a root. <laughs> this cooker. This is the Unbelievable. The junk drawer, isn't it? Yeah, everyone has one. Expiry date on the tablet, 16. 2016? That's the expiry date. So yeah. Style. Got some boots down here. Got some boots. Angela, lighters, clips. Nail varnish, ribbons, this is like, oh, there's bits and bobs in here. Is it? Yeah, nail varnish, ribbons, clips. Very dark in here, isn't it? it? Is. Got some work jackets here. Wow. Healthcare, environmental. Mmm. No TV in here. That's what I noticed straight away. Let's have a look over here. Let's see what we got. Blender, doesn't look too old. A few thermos flasks. Got some tablets here. Expiry 7, 2017. Ah, some knitting stuff. Not really sure what that is. Bit of a, uh, is it a gas, gas heater? Yeah. What are you saying, on phone? <laughs> Remember them? I remember him, I had one about two years ago. <laughs> yeah. Well, here you are, guys. Fridge here. Let's see if there's any food, if I can open it. Filters. That's what you keep in your fridge. There's some Gallo wine, though. Can't really see a date on that. Shame we got here so uh, late because the outside's absolutely stunning. So it's a right shame. The joke, bud. Yeah. Load of candles there too. Yeah. We got lights. Wonder if these work. Doubt it. No, no lights. It's a proper little hideaway, isn't it? Mm -hmm. 
wonder if it was maybe a holiday cottage. What do you think? It feels like it. Yeah. Ooh. Love this old fireplace, so. TCP. What's TCP? Antiseptic. Is it? March 09. Oh nine, yeah, but people keep stuff like that, don't they? I've just looked at them. Renee Ian. What does that do? It's heartburn indigestion. When were these from? Seventeen. Uh, heartburn's nothing to get excited about. No, these have been out of stock. They stopped making them because in America they found a um, cancerous yeah. thing in it. They've stopped making them for the past year and a half. And that's why I bring Lisa along for little facts like that. Because I don't know nothing about stuff like that. Oh my god. What? Diazepam. Why are we excited about that? Because it's a controlled drug. They would take some. Thanks, I've seen the effects of that on my customers. No, oh, sad. <laughs> my customers. Right, I'm going to head into this next room. Kitchen. Tiny little kitchen. This is definitely a holiday house, guys. Oh, look at this wallpaper. All picture frames, that's funky. Oh, oh God, no such a spider. What? No such a spider. It's dead, though. We are minus £293 in the emergency. Yes. I know. As if you just swore. I'm trying not to swear. I am a creator, I am abundant, I am confident, I am love. I am grateful, I am perfect, I am blessed, I am strength, I am immaculate, I am wealth, I am happiness, I am joy, I am thankful, I am healthy, I am yeah. healed. Love words. It's a bit like um, Look, a self-help thing that, isn't it? Yeah, it's funky, Look, isn't it? How nice is that? Yeah. Some beers and stuff like oh, that. little tea bags. Actual tea bags still in there as well, guys. It it must be like a little holiday. It is, isn't it? Oh, <laughs> yeah. Look at that, and you all asked for free products. And this this guy's just left them all here. The girl's bucket. Hmm. All right, what do we have under here? Another fridge. <clears throat> Empty again. Clean and stuff. <clears throat> hey, look at that pizza tray. We've got one of them. Yeah. That's cool. It's cleaner than ours. <laughs> <laughs> Well, you know, one of them things. Oh, look at these little Christmas lights as well. Yeah, they're funky, aren't they? Yeah. All right, let's have a little look in this uh, bathroom here. Oh, this is tiny. Look at this. Oh, my God, look at your head. It's touching the ceiling. I'm bent down. I'm bent down. Let me in. I'm five foot seven. There you go. Oh, look at the rabbits on the wall. Have a little nosy in them drawers. Yeah, well, watch out the way. <laughs> oh. oh, there's hair! There's what? There's hair. Let me see. There's actual hair. Ew, that's out the plug. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, a little thermometer. Don't be touching stuff like that. It might be a rectal. You don't know. A few bits in here, though, isn't there? Yeah. Shaver's toothbrush and that. You crawl powder. <laughs> That's cool. We've not really seen much evidence for the date though, have we? Whoa. I know, look how low it is. Can we get some room, please? Yeah. Some manoeuvre. I've got my big coat on, remember? This bathtub here, all the stuff still left on there. Yeah, let's have a look in their drawers. Cupboard. It's weird how all this is just left here. All like sanitary products and hair dye and everything. Very strange. Listen to her rooting away. Proper scouser. <laughs> Getting through everything. It's all that I am. The much in there? It's like the spoons, all the cutlery. Is it? Yeah. Look. Oh, that's cool, oh, isn't it? The trees. Because everything is still here. Yeah. It's definitely a little holiday home. Oh. Isn't it? Yeah. Head through. Oh, it opens out a little bit here, doesn't it? Yeah. Bedroom. Yeah, clothes left. Oh, look at all these little shelves. Oh, yeah, look at that. That's cool. It's dead interesting, isn't it? Yeah, I love it when they've left everything. Look at all these shelves. 
Why would you need so many staples? That suspicious amount of staples. <gasps> More hair! What? More hair left behind. Hmm. Extensions. It's like she was shedding. Oh, makeup drawer! That's like a kid's thing, really, isn't it? Them headbands are tiny. Still sell this in our shop now. Yeah. Carbon oil treatments and all that. Oh, this is. Oh, that's a. Ew. No, let's not touch that. Strange room, this. It is. It's like a spare room, I'm going to say. Ugh. Oh, they boxes. And underpants. Union Jack underpants. <laughs> and some deep heat. Oh my god, what went on in this house? Man United fan, though, obviously. We don't judge. A few more bits in there. Well, wow, it's so interesting, isn't it? Yeah. Proper little, uh, what's that, laser? It's only a it's laser pen. No, but I didn't like the hair. Do you want some baby oil? No, I don't trust you with it. <laughs> right, so Lisa's just pointed this out to me. It's my boy David Icke. Any conspiracy theorists out there will know what he's about. He thinks uh, there's lizard people. And there's people out there, elitists trying to run the world and stuff like that. The perception, deception, or it's all bollocks. Yes, all of it. But David Dye is a really interesting guy, to be fair. But that leads us on to this guy was a pure conspiracy theorist. My type of guy. But that's interesting. So I wonder where he went with his conspiracy theories. Mm -hmm. This is my type of place, this. This is how I'm going to end up when they find me one day. <laughs> I'll be in my boxers in an armchair reading David Icke. <laughs> oh, right, let's head through. So my friend Lucy's actually been here. Forget me not, Urbex. Or forgotten places. One of them. Uh, one of them's right. It's a bit awkward. I forgot which one it is. But she said that she'd use this as a zombie apocalypse bunker. And I can see why, to be fair. Here's a proper little time capsule. Drink. I'm aware of the drinking game when I say certain words. But uh, while Lisa's still having a nosy up there, I think we should head upstairs and see what we can find there. Upstairs. Okay. What? Do do? There's a date. 2014. Ah. Notice of impact impending. What's that mean? We still have not paid off the above debts, unfortunately. This means we, we may recommend our client they should issue a, a claim against you in court. Oh. Oh dear. Maybe that's why the house is abandoned. April 14. So there could be a repossession. Yeah. And they've just left it. They've gone out of it, but yeah right shall we head upstairs with these exposed pipes it's very small up here these stairs are very small as well oh let's head up oh wow this is nice have you ever seen mccoy's in bacon sizzler yeah
go bad. This is nice though. I love this. Look at that partition. That's amazing, isn't it? Yeah. It's gorgeous, that. Primo. You out of breath going upstairs? I was laughing. All right. <laughs> I was going to say, have a word. <laughs> Yeah, it is. Look, it's all holiday little bits, isn't it? Tennis rackets, yeah. badminton, uh, football shin pads and that. Anything like that? Shells? Shells. What's that? A picture of a Native American. You can't say Indian. I mean, Native American. Oh my God, you'll get me cancelled. <laughs> you have to be careful these days. What's this? This is uh, strange, isn't it? The pipe just coming straight out the wall, huh? They may have had a, a heater there, you know. Yeah. I think they would have. Crop circles. Oh. There's not been many crop circles then. <laughs> but it looks like our man was into the UFOs. Like Maybe he was abducted. Maybe. Probably not. Oh, a few bits over here. Let's have a look. Shoes. Oh my god. There's little plugs and that. Just a bit of storage here. What are you oh my god in at? Oh, you know what? Through the floor, oh, huh? Here's my favourite film on video. And he's got DVDs of David Attenborough. What a lad. He's my kind of man. got good taste. Jurassic Park. Jurassic Park as well. Oh, he's a good one. He is. He likes aliens. And he likes all this stuff, so. Matrix. Fast and Furious. He's a good man. He's got taste. Let's Natural have a little look for Nacho Libre. <laughs> He's got taste. Yeah. My boy's got taste. Wow. The TV there. This was missing from downstairs. Maybe they had a uh, when they came they had a break from TV. Oh, so small up here though, isn't it? Yeah. Wow, look at them shoes. That's a right collection there, isn't it? Yeah. Empty wardrobe there. It's not much room up here. No. Not there's only two of us and we're bumping into each other. It's cool though, isn't it? Yeah, I love this. Nice little uh, find, isn't it? Yeah. Is that a bookshelf? Yeah. Oh, yeah, I'll step out. Too small. It is too small. I'm loving this though. This is nice. Do you think they've put that in themselves? Just as a part partition? Yeah. Or is it maybe an attic that they've converted? Yeah. Doesn't feel the safest, to be honest. Yeah. Look at these yeah. I think this is a proper DIY job, to be fair, oh. of a conversion. It's just tacked in, isn't it? Yeah. That's all. Oh. Yeah. Proper little thumbtacks in. Nothing major. All these shoes and that though. This is absolutely full. And it is quite big. Of women's shoes. What size are you, Lisa? Seven. A seven. These are a six. Oh, close. You could have got yourself some uh, stinky second hand shoes there. Yeah. <laughs> I'll pass. No, we don't take stuff. We're all right, aren't we? Wow. Totem pole. Yeah. Into the Indians. Yeah. Into the what? Oh, no. <laughs> yeah. I'm getting cancelled. <laughs> They're Native Americans. Yeah, getting cancelled. They're Native Americans. Do you know why they called them Indians? Yeah. Because when Columbus went there, he thought, he'd dis he thought it was India. So when he seen them, he was like, you guys are Indians. And they're like, no, we're not. And like, yeah, you're Indians. And then it just stuck. So, you know, a bit rude, like, to be honest. We're American. Nah, you're Indians. Um, I'll probably get told that's wrong in the comments by my American uh, subscribers, but... Wow. We're winging it. We wing history in this channel. Wow. She's been knitting something she hasn't finished. It's oh. part of knitted look. They're uh, turtleneck. Blanket. Yeah, it looks like a blanket. It does, isn't it? A baby blanket. Oh. That's cool, though. Yeah. 
So that's pretty much it for inside. There is a lot of caravans and things like that outside, which we can have a look at. It's a bit dark, but should be all right. Oh, oh my God, look at these cobwebs. They've actually put carpet on the walls here as well. Look at this. So it's a full on DIY job, this place. But yeah, should we have a look in the caravans in that? They look like there's quite a bit of stuff in them. Yeah. Let's do it then. Sorry. Let's like, get some nice photos. It's only small. It? It's all a day cottage. Yeah. What do you think it was? I don't know. It's just one to another room. Oh my god. I'm never happy, are you? <laughs> right, we'll head outside. Get some shots first, then we'll head outside. Yeah. Right, so we're heading out. Leave that exactly how we found it. There we go. And it's pitch black now. Yes, I'm scared. <laughs> what are you scared of? <laughs> Aliens. Don't be silly. They might come back. But it's gorgeous little uh it's definitely a holiday home. Yeah. It's absolutely still though around here, isn't it? There's no noise or but well uh, let's have a little look in his caravan. Might have to take this bag off, you know. Yeah. Oh, my hat fell off. This hat's doing my head in. Yeah. Oh, hang on. What? I can't see you. The thing's undone. Right, and as if nothing happened, we're back. And we're going to have a little look in this caravan. I don't know if anyone's seen 2012, the film, with Woody Harrison. But it's definitely one of those type of caravans. So much stuff left in here as well, isn't there? There's a lot of stuff down there. It looks like a tent, some lawn mowers, things like that. Right, it's hard to see where to start, really. I don't really know where to start. There's so much stuff here. There's a lot of junk, to be fair. Yeah. Isn't there? Chinese. A lot of camping stuff. Hey, look at that. That's funky. The fridge painted. Wow. Is interesting like. What's that? I don't know. Old Penny. Corona. Oh my god, don't touch it! <laughs> Corona. Alright, oh, okay. Safe. Alright, let's go head over to that other caravan. Oh, that's me. Oh. Better condition. <laughs> <laughs> right, let's head over. Because you can't really make anything out. I hate it when it's like that. Mm. Do you know what I mean? Uh, but there is quite a few bits out here. I wonder if he came up here looking for UFOs, you know. Because it's very clear sky. Yeah. It's a bit like wrong turn over here. Are you nervous? It's just pitch black. It is pitch black. Whoa, nearly went flying there mattress and things like that there's no double bed so why is there a double mattress oh this floor seems Ooh. like there's going to be a trap underneath it no that's why i didn't stand there i just said it's like a trap go on then <laughs> a a pound stretcher. he's a trolley thief he is absolute trolley thief i've gone off him uh, there's nothing worse than when you want to go and you want the wheelie baskets and they've all been taken. People like him ruin society. You're going to fall through something there. I've got a feeling about that. It's just his little workshop. Yeah. Deliverance. He obviously didn't know what that was. What have we got there? Hmm, very strange. A few jars and tables and that under there. Strange, isn't it? Oh my god, look at the size of that. Which? <laughs> One nil. One nil. Right, I'm going to head over and look at this other caravan. Because there's something dodgy about that, I don't like it. Wrong turn. 
My man likes conspiracies though. He's all about the uh, aliens and UFOs. Don't mind me. <laughs> <laughs> Don't you worry. Whoa! Ha! Karma. Hey, it's dangerous. No, I don't like them. Roy Keane's scary at the best of times. Never mind in an abandoned house. David Beckham. Oh my god. 90s Beckham, that is. Look how dark it is. We're going to turn around and there's going to be a face there. Uh... What? It's true. The look. Nice. Look at this. It's creepy. But there's the other caravan. That's. It. Did you hear that? Sound like a dog. Look how dark. That's where the uh, we were looking down the hill before. But here's the caravan. Imagine someone's in there. I'm scared. I'm scaring myself. What was what? I think it was a cow. Not sure. Right, but let's have a little look. Oh, thank God. <laughs> thank God it's locked. Serious vibes about this, isn't there? You don't like this? No. I don't like this, you know. I felt safe in the house. We're out in the wilderness now. Can't see nothing. Right. Can we see in there? It doesn't look like there's much in there. It's quite good condition. But I think we'll let that be because... A bit strange, isn't it? It's a bit strange. So we're going to head down <coughs> to the road and then we'll catch up with you back down there because if I shine this light in my face, I'm going flying. We're heading down this path again now. So bear with guys, bear with. Ugh. Sheep. It's sheep. That scared me then, it scare you. <laughs> right. You can't really see down this road even with the big light on. But we just heard that movement down there and our asses went. Turns out it was just sheep, so we're all right. Shine that in front so I can see. There we go, I was walking off to the side there. Didn't even know. Right, so we figured out the guy's name was Carl. He was into conspiracies. And that was kind of his hideaway or holiday home. However you want to put it. I like hideaway. Sounds nicer. Something I'd have. But anyway, if you've enjoyed that, guys, remember to like, comment and subscribe. Hit notification bell so you don't miss any future explores. Me and Lisa are off to the next one now in the dead of night. Can't wait. And we'll see you on the next one then, guys. Cheers. See you next week.